Huh? That's some gas. Yeah. Yeah, whatever he doing, I'm with him. You know what I mean? Whatever Ro trying to do. Yeah. I'm on deck. I'm from um, Uptown. I was about to say. Every preseason for one. It was not no other case but nothing else. Everybody from uptown was guns. Everybody from Kansas City was drugs. Yep. Everybody from South Philly was shooting. Yep. And everybody at West was just scattered with a little bit of everything. Like five years ago, all the uptown niggas in there for attempts. Then that shit died down. Where he at over there? Uh, What's up with you, bro? How are you? Nigga hey, got it rocking. Mm-hmm. Make sure I don't step on nothing important. Yeah, yeah. Hey, shit, bro. How are you? Good to see you. You always good to see you, bro. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. How are you? I'm good. I'm sure. Right. Yeah, you can go with that. It's just the intro. We're gonna change it. It's just the intro for now. But we're gonna change that. Yeah, this is uh, my office. Sammy, you can see on the like this every time. In the name of love. You ain't gonna have a Jeep. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna cap like I ain't, I ain't really been listening to Kel shit because a lot of his songs sound like the charges. So it's kinda hard to ignore. And I ain't really been listening to Ye shit ever since he went off the deep end either. So yeah. I try to separate the art from the people and in certain instances I can. Yeah. But certain shit is just like too detrimental and I be in my head too much. So I just I I'd rather listen right. to something that I ain't gotta think about. I, I you know agree. what I mean? I gotta feel guilty about it. <laughs> I agree. I agree with that. I feel the same way. I feel that now that I know what I know and then listening to the lyrics like seems like you're ready. Like, no. Nah. But y'all gotta think about it. How old are you to be ready for what we talking about? This happened now. Y'all gotta think about this. That man been writing and making all these type of songs before all these allegations even came. Oh no, those songs is about to leave. And them allegations, <laughs> them allegations is going strong for like 15 we years now. We might know it's about Aaliyah, but a lot of people really didn't know. They just knew R. Kelly no, and that's the that freaky guy. I'm not, I'm not mad songs. at other people. Like, I really, I understand people that say that they can separate the art from, but in certain instances, it's harder for them. You know oh, what I mean? And that's like, understandable. Even like, so you, um, you if somebody made, like if I had a favorite drill rapper, right. and all he was talking about was how he was untouchable, and then he got touched. Every time I hear them songs, it's gonna feel weird. It's gonna feel weird, right? Because it's like, yo, you, uh, you talked all this damn it, Willie you might have done that to yourself. Like, right. you know, it's all kind of angst depending on what kind of mood you in, Thanks. that your mind goes with that. And now you caught up in that and not figuring out your next move, Thanks. which I really, really need to do. <laughs> I agree. Again, I agree. That's how I feel. You can't be out here kicking the Willie Bobo, man, the Pop Piper, and all this other BS, man. You know what I'm saying? The Pop Piper. <laughs> Come on. The ball was doing this. Yeah. Right Copy. in front of y'all the whole right time. Right the whole time. <laughs> he was giving it to you the whole time what type time he was on. You feel me? But they sound yeah. for it though. Hey. You won't pay for it. What is done in the dark shall come to the light. But I mean, I on one thing, we can keep talking about how much time he did. I know he the star. But there's a lot of people implicit in that shit, and I'm trying to figure out if other motherfuckers are being held accountable because Copy. Right. it becomes ringish. Copy. Right. Or technically, I guess it would be a ring. Yeah, yeah. Cultish. Yeah. Cultish. Everybody yeah. has to be responsible. Cultish. Everybody needs to be accountable. Yeah. And it's funny that you say that, Sammy, because I was talking to somebody else about it. That's why I made this one of my topics. Okay. And that's basically, you know, where that person was going at. Like, he's getting all the blame, but he's not the person that helped. He's not even smart enough Organi- to, right, to organize or, or, or congregate the whole, whole situation. Like, there's yeah, people that are in places. They go out and they talk to the, you know, the person to bring the person in. You know, Same he with has Epstein. Help. Epstein has shorty on his hip all the time to do Definitely. her job. Right. Motherfuckers, yeah. like, you gotta think, like, even just in, in general, your homegirl, the perfect wingman, right? Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's real shit. So you know about that. You know about having the four girls as, as wing wing men you or wing women. Yeah, shit. You are I'm right yeah. up for you. What goes on out, out of town? Stay out of town. Shit, you want help? 
I just done it. <laughs> yeah. I done had plenty of niggas. Flo, who that? I want to let I got you. Listen, whatever happened between y'all, that short them come back in telling me some bullshit. I can float yeah. this. But does that make you apprehensive about the handoff now that there's so much attention on the front No, because I ain't got nothing to do with what y'all do after Sorry. I done introduced Sorry. you. And I ain't mad, I'm just asking. That's it. I have nothing to do with it. Don't come to me trying and tell me all your business. business. Exactly. Because yeah. I don't care. I want to hear that ish. Yeah. I'm one of them. That's I ain't You're a good girlfriend. I am. That's why I'm thorough as shit. No doubt. That's why you're on my show. That's <laughs> why she's flotorious. Exactly. Flot, flotorious. Yeah, <laughs> she is. We all. <laughs> she is. Oh my God. <laughs> Bathing all of that flow. That's your moment, baby. It's always been my moment. No, okay. <laughs> well, hey, well, we just added a little bit more light to it. How about that? Thanks. You know what I mean? I'm about to flow. You got to No, that's, yeah, that's dope. But I, like I said, me being a guy, I can appreciate that. Stay the that's out of our business. Listen. That's always the best. I already told you, follow me, the Flotorious song. The Flotorious song. The Flotorious Chronicles coming to a city near you. Too many opinions, too much confusion. Yeah. Hey, you know, it is what it is. Yep. I got another question. I got another question. Shoot for it. Shoot for it. Copy that. Um, shout out to her series, Surviving Philly. Absolutely. Shout out. Philly Wonder Woman, all y'all, man. Hold your head. Definitely. Everybody holds your head. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully everybody can come together and keep it going in honor of CEO Novi. That would be dope. You know, CEO Row Experience definitely promotes and supports that type of movement. You dig me? Absolutely. 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 Um, Novi is somebody that it's crazy when the pictures start going up, you realize how long you've known this person. Like, we've been running around this motherfucker since before the media side shit. I might not even accept the same yet. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like Novi's been around. And she been around me and mine. And, and, and I'm just looking. Somebody, it's good to see her appreciate it, but this one, I, I woke up to it. I, Right, I woke up to the, t I see the text, I'm, I couldn't yeah, I believe it myself. I texted him, I felt about, I, I ain't no hand. I was confused. Yeah, I couldn't believe that. So, man, definitely, um, uh, rest in peace to that young lady, somebody rest that, in peace. uh, we were supposed to find time to get on the pod and I didn't get a chance to, bro. But it's mm -hmm. all good. So, but I had her on the fly me a couple times, and uh, she sent me the winner of her last competition, so, you know, it's mm -hmm. all love, but we don't miss no video. No nope. definitely on this movie. Oh, you got your own glasses and shit? Oh man, I'm, I'm on there, baby. You got your own glasses? Um, yeah, man, now you're gonna be sipping with CEO. I should have bought you. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna be sipping yeah. with CEO. Hold up. Exactly. I wanna, I wanna see your real glasses. It's cut. only one of them? You're gonna be sipping with CEO, baby. How much do you cut? Yeah. I'm gonna what? I need the first one, man. No doubt. <laughs> we'll discuss that after the show. Yeah, you got a lot of Yeah, get your CEO row mug, man. I'll put that on the Sipping show. Sipping with CEO row, man. Yeah. You dig what I'm saying? It's a good Beautiful choice. Niche. Good quality. It, yeah, I appreciate it, man. I'm proud of you too, bro. You picked the one style of cup I didn't get yet. I don't know. Okay. That's a good one. <laughs> Shouts out to Sister Fatima, my assistant. Yeah, shout out to Sister Fatima. She's, she's, was like, nope, she's freaking awesome <laughs> when she wants to be. You know what I'm saying? That's dope. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good sister team. And the logo is heavy, by the way. Oh, yeah. The logo is heavy. It looks like my guy. That's lemonade, y'all. That's really good. It's nice and cold and icy. Yeah. Yeah. And I see your logo. Flo, did you know Logan? Yeah. Yeah. Have you ever I heard about know. her? I heard about it, but I heard about it. No, yeah. she's a great young lady. Yeah. Very young lady. Did anybody go to the Roots picnic? No. I regretfully skipped out. Um, I actually was, you know how you literally just need a, a mental break? Yeah. It was one weekend where I couldn't bring myself to go out there. And I wanted to support because Suzanne Christine. Suzanne like, Christine. Shouts out to Suzanne Christine. We love you. Know, the podcast boys, his family, and they had a yeah. podcast yeah. section. So, like, I wanted to support, but it was literally like, if I go out this weekend, I'm not going to be good next week type of thing for me. Okay. I had to chill. I had to chill. Mm -hmm. and all yeah. uh, did anybody go to a doom day? It wasn't even too many people out there ever since that, you know, that shoot man. Mm -hmm. I, 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 really I thought it was, I thought they out. had a decent turnout. I'm not sure I didn't go, but from what I saw, it looked like it was a decent turnout. I was probably good, but yeah, yeah. 
I feel how you feel. I mean, we do a lot. And at times, sometimes I forget certain things and I need to rest. Listen, I need my, I need my rest. I need my peace of mind so I can wake up with a fresh one it's and I'm able to plot and plan. Because yeah. if you're not, your body will do it for you. No doubt. Will. No doubt. You'll wind up in a coma. You'll wind up your legs ain't moving. Exhausting. Copy. And your body will tell you you're not going to work. Yeah. No way. And I'm not fighting to get dead. I'm trying right. to, you know what I'm trying to yeah. yeah. So sometimes you just gotta smoke and watch uh, Marvel movies and <laughs> so, like, <laughs> get you a, a sipping with oh, oh, get you a sipping with Sammy just mug, get you a sipping with CEO sure. mug, and sit back, roll something and watch a Marvel comics movie. You know what I'm saying? Or a horror flick or a psychological thriller, but make sure you continue to support black businesses. You dig what I'm saying? That part. And I just found love for Gal Ga um, Guardians of the Galaxy. Mm -hmm. Bro, that shit is hilarious. That's, my That's funny. That's both of them. Hilarious. But yeah, um, shout out to Jermaine Quick. I will be at the Sugar premiere tomorrow. I just want to salute my guy, man. Okay. Jermaine shout Quick. out to Jermaine Quick. Shout out. Definitely a dope director in the city. Um, years ago, he shot a video at one of my cookouts. You might have mm -hmm. been there, bro. Mm -hmm. And oh, okay. just watching him grow. He's having a premiere at the Ritz tomorrow. He done shut down all the theaters at 69th Street before. He's That's what's so up. That's what's up. Congratulations, yeah. guys. Check out his episode on the Simple Sandy Podcast also when he talks about shit. He bought the comic book, the eight pens. He, he loaded. No doubt. No doubt. Since you said Black Venice and I was talking about Marvel. Shout out to the I had to bring it back. Yeah, shout out to the homie quick, man. Keep, keep trailblazing. Shout him out. Keep trailblazing. That's what we all about, man. Right. Also, if you would like to uh, advertise your business on the CEO Road Experience, please get at me, DM me at official underscore CEO dot RO. So we can uh, discuss pricing. And every time my show airs, your business will be displayed. Um, during my music segment. Yeah. And also importantly, build relationships. Build a relationship with this guy. Yeah. He's one of the ones that I'll say is worth building a relationship with. Absolutely. Get your ass on this couch, whichever way it takes to get you on this couch, right. and have the whole conversation and get the full exposure and the full experience because it's important. And it's not just because of CEO role situation. I'm tagging it because of CEO role situation. Yeah. But just in general, build these relationships and stop just spending money with people and, and treating them like servants. Yeah. No doubt. I appreciate that, brother. That you means know, a lot. You, you, if you can't be used, you're not useful. So we get that. Yeah. But we, we got to respect the way that we handle each other. And we get yeah. further, like you said. Yeah. You know what I mean? One yeah. fist. Yeah. So we feed, no doubt. I appreciate